Hello, I am Static, and today we're going to be looking at modding your Xbox, putting add-ons in, things like that, to, without using the old style UFO transfer. What you are going to need is my Files Explorer, and possibly File Downloader. Uh, I don't use it very often, I use my Files Explorer most all the time. Uh, it's great, uh, it does have a trial version, I'm not sure how long it lasts, I paid $250 for it, so... Uh, I love it. If you're going to do a lot of modding, uh, it's worth it. So to get started, Microsoft Edge. I've got something pulled up here already. Let's say the Nissan Skyline. You want to skyline your game in Minecraft, drive the ground. Works really well. Uh, what you want to do is go down to the bottom. Of course, you can put in anything you want. Go to search. I'm on Minecraft Pocket Edition. Go to search for any kind of mod. This is a kind of a great side. A lot of them work real well. Some of them don't. Scroll to the bottom and get your behavior pack and your resource pack. I want to start off with the behavior pack. Click it. It's going to uh, bring up a download site. <clears throat> Hover over your download. Hit A. Give it just a moment. I think we'll start flashing. Okay, let's close this one. Save as is what you want to do. Don't need any of that transfer stuff. It's going to save it as a MIC add-on. You can change that later. Save it whatever folder, file, save it wherever you want to. I just save mine in downloads. Save. Download it. Hit the Xbox button. Go to My Files Explorer. This is where it gets great. Really easy to do this. So when you're in here, I'm going to go to My Library. Open that up. This brings up all the folders. It's in that section where you just saved. So if you saved it in any of them, this is where you're going to find that. Scroll downloads. Skyline right here. What you want to do first is hit the start button and rename. You don't want it to be a big app. You want it to be a zip. So all the way up here. It'll be all the apps. You just write zip. And a on enter. Then hit B to back out the window. All right, as you can see right now, it's a zip. You want to hit start again and extract. Give it just a moment, it'll be extracted. You have a new folder pop up right here Nissan Skyline R34B for behavior pack. Extract it. Okay, yeah. and there is your behavior pack. So, what you'll want to do is you'll want to hit start again, copy folder. Once you do that, it's copied. You will go over to isolated storage. <clears throat> this is where it gets a little tricky if you haven't did any of this before. So once you click the isolated storage, you'll see up here at the top, your links. Go to packages. With old UFO, you had to look everything up in here. You don't have to do that anymore. Scroll down. You find that this one right here, Microsoft Minecraft UWP console. <clears throat> You want to hit A on that. When it brings it up, you'll go to local state. Hit A on that. Go to games. Com.mojo. And in here is where you will be putting all of your add-ons and mods for your Xbox. If you don't have them yet, slowly you will be increasing the different folders in here for different things that you do. <clears throat> like the behavior pack that we just downloaded. If you've never done this before, you won't have a folder in here called Behavior Pack, so you need to make one. To do that, just hit Start. See, it's already on a folder. Let's move back out of here. Go up above it, hit Start, and then type New Folder. I ain't going to do that because I already got one, of course. All lowercase. You want to make sure everything's all lowercase on this. Right, behavior underscore Pack. Save it. When you get it saved, you'll have this folder just like this. You want to click this folder, and these are all the different behavior packs that I got. So now you want to hit start and paste. When you hit paste, it'll take a minute to paste everything in there, and then you will have your Nissan Skyline R34 behavior pack. And this is everything that comes with it, of course. You don't really worry about any of that right now unless you want to change it around, the way it works, this and that. 
so when you get done with all of that, you'll want to go back to the same process as you just did with the behavior pack, but do it with the resource pack as well. Bring it all the way back here. You want to do the same thing. You want to hit start, not on a folder, of course. Start new folder A, and you want to name it resource packs. All lowercase. I'm sure that error will know how to find it. Resource underscore packs. And open it up, and you'll want to paste it in here. I've got quite a few in here already. Uh, it works out really well. So now I will show you how it works. Let me take just a moment to load up my game. So I will show you. I've got lots of. Uh, Resource packs, behavioral packs, this works out really easy. It's a lot quicker, it's a lot easier than using uh, UFO transfer. Uh, I've got a big city that I've been building, and when you're building a big city, to put the cars in it and the choppers from the SCP packs in it and things like that, it makes it really, really nice. It brings a lot of detail to your city. Uh, it's going to take a little while to load up, it seems, here, but we will get there. <laughs> If you have any issues, I don't mind helping as much as I can, as much as possible. A lot of times when you go to those download sites, if it don't give you the option to save as, you can hover over the link and hit start and copy link and then go back to uh, file downloader, the way, uh, the way everybody used to do it with UFO transfer. But uh, once you save it, save the URL, it, uh, then you can just go back to my file explorer. Yeah. You don't need the import. Most of the time, from my Minecraft below. Sneaking user data. Let's see. Come on, boost up, boost up. Let me show you some cars and some choppers and. Things like that there. Make sure that it works. Hit the level load. There we go. I got tons of resource packs, tons of mods on this thing. It takes forever for it to load. Let's go to my super city. Here we are. I have, I think, 12 or 13 different resource packs, behavior packs on this city. <clears throat> I have a lot of issues on that Minecraft PE Lite site on Microsoft Edge. There's a lot of issues with a lot of the add-ons, a lot of the mods, a lot of them don't uh, work the way they should. We have issues or they don't work well with other resource packs or other behavior packs, so it may crash your game a lot, depending. So you'll, you'll get a feel for that the more you add and the more you take away. Send them, uh, send them these messages. You can uh, comment however you want to do it, and I will help out the best that I can. Just kind of let it load. Do, 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 do. Don't kill dolphins, monsters. Oh man, what do you know? It's taking a whole five minutes, but we are here. Oh. Oh, there it is. New police station I just built. Let's find out where we're at. Oh, here's Walmart. And here are the stars. They're not stars. But they will be in the menu. So we're not here to help, of course. And you'll have all these different skylines red, white, full series, police, edition. Uh, these are SCP tactical cargo trucks, attack helicopters. These are Tesla roadsters, Tesla semi trucks, all kinds of different mods and add ins you can put in the game. Let's see. 
just put one over here just to show you that it works. And I'll put it down. There you go. You can actually get in it and drive it. But anyway, leave a comment, give me a like. Pretty neat, pretty easy to do. I uh, thanks for watching my video and I'll help out this again. Thanks.